So, I had a Why Am I Single Part 1. So, here's Part 2. I think I've had some time to think about this. I think that I am single because I feel like I cannot <laughs> get along with anybody. Seriously, it's like I have some really cool people, but when it comes to certain things, I'm really, really strong minded. I stand, I take a stance and I stand behind it no matter what. I'm really, when I get an idea, especially about, hmm, I'm going to say especially about things like abuse, I do not, I don't care if I touch your arm or if I'm yelling or whatever, you don't have the right to put your hands on me because you put your hands on me going to be consequences and repercussions but anyway me and my friend my best friend 22 years we were on the phone and we were talking about <laughs> we were talking about one of her family members and we were talking about an incident well she was talking about an incident where she was in the car and <laughs> she actually felt bad for this person because they were listening to this song, and she was like, I kind of like the song, but I didn't like, I, she was like, I kind of like the song, but I quite, I didn't quite want to hear it right at the time, but she was just a backseat passenger anyway, you know, so this is like her cousin's boyfriend at the time, and <laughs> she said the song, song came on, he was singing it, he got all the way to the chorus, and her cousin cut the song off and had this look on her face like <laughs> like you're getting on my fucking nerves when he was singing. <laughs> so so she said she felt bad for him and um she was like, Well, I got that song at home, you know, you know listening to it when we get when you, you know drop a when we get to my place or whatever, we got all listen to the song. And so they get to her house and everything. Everybody chilling out. She give him the CD and stuff. And he was like, yeah. You got any anything else that I could listen to or whatnot? So. The main reason I brought that up was because. I thought that was extremely rude. <laughs> that she would cut the song off while he was listening to it. Now. I'm somewhat like that. <laughs> it's like, if I'm, I don't know, I can't say I'm like that. Because that was just totally rude to do that to her boyfriend. I just think it's like certain, certain times where I can't get along with a person. I really can't. I can't get along with them. Because... I'm so used to being by myself. I'm so used to being by myself. Like, right now, I don't, I sleep all over the bed. <laughs> I don't feel like I should be down to half a piece of bed because I got to sleep in the bed with somebody. <laughs> but seriously, like, if I had a boyfriend, he would have to stay, like, in his own place seriously I mean we would have to live apart because I learned my lesson I actually lived with somebody last year at the beginning of last year and we had fun for a while it was like really fun but oh my freaking god this dude <laughs> oh my god okay first of all oh Oh, gosh. When he finally did get a job, it was a temp job, which I didn't care that he didn't have a job because I just really liked him. But he came home, oh, gosh, and took off his shoes. <laughs> and I was just like, ooh, 
Don't do ever do that again in your life while I'm asleep. It it was terrible. And he like just <laughs> he just sat there like it was all good. And the smell was the room was like it wasn't that big. I swear it was like I don't even know measurements for rooms, but it was not that big. And the font just filled the room up in like three seconds. And I was just like, oh my God. And then, oh, he wanted me to wash the socks. He left the socks on the floor. Oh, and I just couldn't touch them because I, ooh, I can do my own laundry. I can deal with my own funk, but oh my God. <laughs> I have never lived with a man like that, ever. <laughs> I've always been by myself or with my mother. And I live with a male now. I do. My son. Oh, I don't understand them. I, I don't understand me. <laughs> I really don't. This guy, he's funny, but oh my God. But anyway, I'm not, I'm not really, okay, I'm, I'm getting off the subject. I'm not used to sharing. I am used to being single. And that's just something that I have to learn. I have to learn how to share. Like, um, I'm really, like, I don't like to share. I only like to share with my immediate family. And that's bad, especially as far as a relationship. I mean... As long as me and the person lives apart, I think we'd be really good. But when it's time to move in together, some stuff I just really um, cantankerous. I just really can't do. Like, um, let's see, another thing when I, oh gosh, I can't believe <laughs> when I first, first, I'm like messy, okay? I'm seriously messy. But I do clean it up when I feel like it's too much, when it's gone too far. This dude does not understand when it's gone too far, okay? Um, He had all types of uh, scientific experiments going on inside of his room. Um, Yeah, like he had plates piled up literally close enough to the ceiling and not only were they piled up like that but it was like stuff growing on the sides and on top of the plates and oh me just thinking about it I'm just getting a little heavish a little pukish mm. but um yeah I'm, I'm I'm running into my time again so I'm going to come back with that thought.